Well, welcome everyone to 305 Goddess channel. Thank you guys for being here with me, subscribing. Welcome. You and your twin flame, honey. Sagittarius. <laughs> Capricorn. Oh. Coming in. I see a wish fulfillment here, but someone may be confused about the love, although they are in love, and they have to move away from that, move beyond that, learning from mistakes, moving forward. So as a drastic shift in perspective comes in, it'll be clear, definitely for you, Pisces, because going out of this will be a loss coming in. And what you have right now is not a difficult partner. Or a possible disappointment. You have an opportunity. Very deep soulmate twin flame opportunity. So you have to keep a lookout for your soulmates. Now that you're clear of that. You're not looking for love in any other places. You're more so just hesitant to take this opportunity you're fearful of repeating past mistakes which you have to damn it oh. move beyond move forward and come up with a strategy but you have to care enough to do so. You don't have to strategize so much in trying to be together, but you must understand how to take soulmate opportunities and be ambition, ambitious <laughs> to continue to build your foundation within your twin flame soulmate situation. But I see a lot of you may be guarded to doing so. So it is a task. Learning. Taking the opportunity. To do so. Hey, yeah. Uh, they want to go nowhere. If you go outside of this, you may find yourself... Lost cards. Mm -hmm. 
so it is a brand new pursuit here but i don't see much people taking it which is you can't move out of it it's not like you're trying to leave your twin flame but you must take some type of different role adventure to gain and move forward some of you may feel a little left out but it's because you have to hold the key and know that you hold it no hold the key to what so some people do want to let go and move out of this storm but eventually i see somehow you'll have to come back okay let's look at now wanting some love out of this situation the lovers beauty union they want a union it, it'll be fulfilling for them someone could be a little selfish but to what be selfish to your soulmates not to your twin flame understanding that energy so they are being guarded to the situation and not really going within understanding what they have to move forward on and from so they are having a hope and trying to keep well actually no they're not they're not really healing themselves so they need that maybe a cleanse could come through somewhere check the description but um maybe they want to i think that's the thing since they want this and things where they just like fuck it then if it ain't if it they want to be heartbroken point like point blank that's the star card with the heartbreak next to it three of swords if they can't have you it is what it is right so if you don't want them that's the hair fine not moving forward even though if they have the attitude like that, they really can't go nowhere also. But it's more like someone has to care enough at the end of the day to build something and move it forward in the right direction and take the opportunity. But they really want it. They keep saying it. They want the opportunity. But here we are. Do they really love it? They kidding themselves on how bright things could be. They act like something else can bring along a better opportunity and get them in a better spot. That that's not the case. Someone else that one of their soulmates can, but not the one that they fucking good. They need to know you are the brightest thing that they can fuck. fucking. Brightest thing fucking the go. Anyhow, but yeah, somewhere in the past they didn't have like somebody kind of drained them of their love. They fought. That's why it's like, can't nobody break their heart any motherfucking more. Not even you. Good place to be, but they need some understanding, okay? So, yeah, they see that you love them. They are willing to be here, but you have to get it right, Virgo. Mm -hmm. Make sure you have it right, all right? So, they are willing to put up the fight for it, the battle. and um, But somehow, like I say, it's hard for them to move forward. It is very hard for them to move forward. You probably moving more forward than they are. Learning from the mistakes. And they are willing to build and they want to build. Why not? What else you gonna do, right? But they are learning to be independent and single. That's why they're more so in the letting go energy because by the time they let go, they figure out what exactly to hold on to. Yeah, because they don't have much passion. They'd rather put the burden down if it's going to be one and not build anything and communicate and go forward. And that's the storm y'all moving out of. And they can still be able to celebrate, especially if you're going to put it up. Let's go on to you, Pisces. So, nine of diamond, you being independent. How they ending somehow. But are you thinking straight? I see you trying to think straight. 
But you need to learn how to be independent. That's gonna, it's going to be more fulfilling for you. Tower coming in. As you stay passionate and, and strategize, right? Use your intelligence. I see where you don't have no even give and take, so you need to really learn and form that. That's going to be, that's what you need to move away from learning from the mistakes yeah you've been with plenty of soulmates that do not give you that even give and take so that's like a pattern you're used to that but not here do not even start that don't do it do not continue it learn how to stop it if that's a pattern and i see you will do that if anything because you're not going to play with how you do your foundation this is your foundation play with it if you want to so here we are um <sighs> Some of you really need to focus because this is going to drain you. King of Diamonds. That's the tower. It's like you put so much into this that you cannot focus at work. And they don't give a damn. They they cool. And, and if anything, they they not don't want to put more on the situation than anything. And I do see you collaborating. So continue to do so. But you need to really, really move from a lot of shit. Learn from some mistakes that was in the past. You got to move from how people treated you. Very important. It's not going to be the same energy you don't want it to be. Don't bring it in. Do not bring that past energy in. Do not. Def, do, I guess what I'm really trying to say, the, the worst thing you can do is compare your twin flame to one of them soulmates. We need to move away from that shit. Six of Swords. As they end up moving away from you, y'all end up moving away from each other. You cannot compare your twin flame to none of your soulmates. Yeah, they not gonna do everything right, but that's that's where you put in the work at. So, yeah, I see you will go within, pay attention and listen and understand what the universe has for you. Put a dead to it. That's the death card. On top of the queen of spades, that's how you're going to strategize. Create a new cycle. Destruct what was in the past. Some renewal coming in. It looks like you happen to be having the hope and the healing. Nope, you're not either. It's like maybe you guys don't need to focus so much on the twin flame relationship. Focus on yourselves right now. Deaths came out first, so you know they need some focus because you not building. So you know you need some focus. Struggling to stay ahead. And are you playing with your manifestations? You just regularly manifestation. Good, you need to go a little bit deeper because they going real deep on us. Real, real deep on us. That they're, they're determined to be independent, just like you need to be. And then as you got as the independent souls come together as one, right? One is still independent. Bill. They learning how to be independent. They letting go because they need to learn how to be independent, and you need to learn how to build. Some of you just don't want to take the opportunity. Some of you didn't take the opportunity. Hopefully that tower came in and you realize how you need to have some temperance and get at least get some love to that. You're not looking for nothing else. Being so fucking unclear of it. So get clear of it, Pisces. All right. Your guard is not up good, but your passion was dwindling because of. So you may need some more information, but hey, go within, understand yourself.
the sun will be shining someone will be getting some clarity good put an end to a lot of shit that was creating this disaster inside of this twin flame energy but a lot of people are not going to understand they're just going to stop the the tangle it's not saying it's a conflict fight whatever it's just like uh they're going to stop to try to build this foundation and put the guard down and have a successful foundation and these be clear of that so i think some clearance to come but you won't even be clear of everything someone will put the fight down there's no need to fight but since you're not so clear of everything it's like you can't be the teacher to lead the class because you don't know everything. Are you trying to find out more information on it? The hair font being reversed. I do see where right now no one has the love to give it's kind of like why not even though the opportunity is that they want the opportunity but you need to learn from some shit before you can really take the opportunity so ain't no love to really give and then someone really wanting to make the magic happen especially them but you making the magic happen at the same time as you moving away from how shit used to be and you moving beyond that beyond that moving forward learning from your past mistakes so now some love could be actually given and the heartbreak is going to be there realizing what you really had to move forward from them even knowing damn i'm glad you moved past that shit <laughs> being clear that again some more um downloads so yeah now someone can actually take the opportunity because it's space and opportunity right that's the moon card it was so cloudy someone couldn't see no true love in it and going forward you still have more to learn on how to build your foundation you know you want this but they look just like well build it if you want it help me help you anyhow y'all need to just learn how to give some love just stop it <clears throat> stop it Put it out. Have some even give and take with each other. Point being, if, you, if you're going to have even give and take with anyone in this motherfucking world, it better be with your twin flame. Get some love. Somebody wanted to get some love to somebody in the past. Maybe your twin flame is in the past. Point being, um, that's how they can be stuck too. Anybody can be stuck because you think you can give some love somewhere else. So understand, bring, bring yourself to the present, which is a very nice gift, and balance that and some realization to come in. Someone realize that's what they was balancing, someone in the past. Mm -hmm. Be very clear of that. Okay, yeah, so it, it's not going to be a gaming situation, even though everybody fulfilled and the sun is shining. But ain't no way y'all can get to your Ten of Pentacles if someone balances somebody else. That's the karma, the world turning. And as the world turns, it's just like sitting down, having a real conversation straightforward with your twin flame. Be like, you know we stuck together, right? So you can't have nobody, I can't have nobody else. We'll never be nothing. <laughs> Night of Wands, get on as the world time, get someone getting on that horse, having a passionate opportunity to go after and being stuck with it. Hangman in reverse because that's how I picked it up. No, that's how it came up. It was like, all right. So, yeah, being stuck together, cool, chilling in your union, okay? But you have to get it right, get it tight.
And let it be very successful. Very, very, very successful. And then here we are getting our happy ending. And I'm pretty sure the Ten of Diamonds will turn around after that. But it's damn sure going to be upside down until then. Mm -hmm. And Ten of Wands, no longer carrying that burden or not going anywhere, right? Just building and rotating in that realm. And King of Wands reverse. <sighs> not being passionate about anyone else. That's controlling the passions. But let me see what I'm reading. It's a lot of brokenness going on because as the karma kicked in, someone was passionate about the, uh, someone else and was very victorious with them, right? Like they, it was, it just was going somewhere, and they began to be happy in that energy, but shit started to fall apart for them very quickly. And they just lost passion for the situation. Mm -hmm. And then that's when you came in. It's like, but they, you are better, Queen of Pentacles. You, you are in a better position than that other person. Or whatever came falling down on them. However, they couldn't see an ending with them. They can see more of an ending with you than them. But they kind of liked it, them. Some shit like that. And then here we are, Seven of Wands. Someone didn't feel like fighting hard for it and knew that. It's just like, oh, I shouldn't have to fight hard for this. Right? So if someone don't want to fight that hard for it, they want it easier. they wait till you give it up easier. Some shit like that. Right? So here we are, Neighbor Pentacles. That's just a small ball. Small ball and no ball in your own court. Right? It's like you need to come up. Nine of Pentacles, be independent. A real independent person will not lowball themselves. Uh uh. Bitch, I got too much to pay for to be playing with you. <laughs> be lowballing. And yeah, yeah, somebody need to make a decision and f figure out where the high ball is and go with the high ball all the time. Like two of wands, getting that passionate sentiment. Um, sentiment, element, setting, have conversations. It's like, are you having conversations long enough before you fuck them? Right? And give some real love to a queen of chalices. That's birthing something, being open to something. Yeah, not being independent, but giving too much love. Queen of uh, Cups. Building. Manifesting. Going forward. Just wanting someone to build with. To fight for, but just picking anyone. Seven of Swords. Being very nasty and conniving. And what do you truly want? Six of Pentacles, no even give and take. That's what it's going to lead you to. Straight up. And just all sleepless. Can't sleep at night trying to figure out where is your person, who is your person. Slow down. Be celibate. Stop fucking before you can get to know someone. Two, three years. Yeah, it take a long time. They tell you don't have sex before you get married. You know how many souls you attach to? Mm-hmm. <laughs> So cut it out while you can, right? Anyhow, find a quiet moment each day to renew your sense of wonder. Do things in your own time. You have two clear cards. You can paint the picture. That's what we are here for, to paint the picture that we have. We created. Other people want to create our picture so bad for us. Let me just add a dash of color. This is my picture. You don't have no picture? <laughs> patience. Be very patient. My, my 
my darling is. I can't say that. Be very patient, my darling. Jewel, you are very sweet, Jewel. Every event in life presents us with a new opportunity to experience ever greater love. There is a new jewel to be found within every teardrop. Trust. We, your angels, are guiding the, the current events. This is the time in which you and those close to you will emerge strengthened by ever greater bonds of love. Trust. There is nothing to fear. There is only love. So have some patience. It's required at this moment you may feel that things are not moving as fast as you would like yet there's a lot going on energetically the current situation causing concerns is evolving positively let go and have patience you will eventually realize that this whole event was in fact the blessing all is perfect as it is trust your eternal love guided There we go. Twin flames, your passion ignites. If you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind. For the heart is the gateway to your soul. So focus on yourself, Pisces, to bring yourself together with your twin flame. It's very important. It's like you all alone in the world. No one there. And all of a sudden, who's that person that I just love so much? <laughs> My twin flame. Lust. I'm telling y'all, just listen. <laughs> Hawaii. No, no, no. Mother, no. No, no, no means no. No, it don't mean yes until yes means yes. Manifest it. That's all you have to do. Manifest if you want less out your life. Manifest celibacy. Be assured of it. And be enlightened. <laughs> All those energies out that we lusting for. Oh, be determined to get your twin flame. Distractions. That's all they are. Health. Bad for your health. Mentioning. Anyhow, manipulative. Very so to get in your drawers. But what do you do? You need to correct yourself. I love you so much, Pisces. Can't wait to see you next time here on the 305 Goddess Channel. Check, check. <laughs> love you, babies. Go have some fun. Not too much. Later.